iOS 26 RC is finally here and this is your last update if you have been using the betas of iOS 26. Of course this will be the last update before Apple releases iOS 26 to the public and as I said if you're on any of the betas the dev beta or the public beta this is your last update and once you have it installed you already have the final version of iOS 26 on your device. So in this video I will show you guys everything you need to know regarding the RC version of iOS 26. Now before we get into all that I just want to ask you for a really quick favor. Most of you guys that watch my videos are currently not subscribed to the channel so if you enjoy the videos and you want to see more of them please make sure you hit that subscribe button it really helps a lot. Now as I said this is the last update for devs and public testers of the betas of iOS 26. Once you have this installed on your device, then you're out of the beta stages. Now, of course, this will come with minor adjustments and improvements. Don't expect to see any big new features or changes on the RC version of iOS 26. Now, another thing you need to know is that once you want to update to the RC version of iOS 26, it means that you're completely reinstalling iOS on your device. That's why this update won't come at the usual 9 gigabytes that all the betas of iOS 26 have been released. This will be a full size update. So based on different devices, we will have different sizes of the update, but expect to see anywhere between 15 to 20 gigs of the update based on of course what iPhone you have or what iPad you're using based on the device this size will be different but it will be quite big so make sure you have enough free storage on your iPhone to install this update. Now installing it of course will be very easy you head on to the general settings right here on the software update you simply go ahead and update to the RC version from here. Now there's one thing you need to know here if you update to the RC as I said you already have the final version of iOS 26 on your device so when iOS 26 gets released to the public you won't actually get an update but what you will get is the next betas of iOS 26 most likely iOS 26.1 beta 1 will be released very soon so if you don't want to continue with those betas make sure that you go to the beta updates right here and turn them off if you leave it on you will get the update for iOS 26.1 right here now currently you install this as I said you already have the public release but if you don't want to install it you want to wait for the public release even though there's no reason you shouldn't do it it's basically the same update then go ahead and just turn off the betas without installing the rc you refresh the page you get nothing here and then once the public release is out you will get it right here on your device so it's as easy as that updating to iOS 26 either the RC or the public release. So what to expect next when it comes to iOS 26? Well with the RC release there should be no more betas of iOS 26 but what could happen is that we get a re-release of the RC version. This has happened in the past it might happen again so if Apple actually decides to release another version of the RC then you might expect it somewhere somewhere on Thursday or maybe even Friday it has happened before as I said so it might happen again or they might actually release a new update with a different build number on the same day as they release iOS 26 to the public. So that's basically it for this video guys this is the RC version of iOS 26. Hopefully the battery life will improve with this release as it actually hasn't been that good with beta 8 and beta 9. Of course we will have to give it a few days to see how it will perform when it comes to battery. Performance is great with iOS 26 we already know that but we'll have to wait and see how the battery will actually do with the new RC of iOS 26. So that is it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will be posting a ton of new videos on iOS 26. So make sure you subscribe for those. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video and if you found it helpful. And I will see you guys on the next one.